What's good, YouTube? It's your Kaylee Bowman back with another video. And as you can see by the title, I'm going to be doing my first cooking with me. Super exciting. So today, guys, I'm going to be making some beef stew. I never made this a day in my life. So today is going to be the day we make beef stew. I'm going to show you guys the whole setup, everything that I got. So I'm gonna make you guys come down a little bit. Y'all, this is like a little jumpy. This video is a little jumpy is because I never did this before. So bear with me. Got some tomato paste. I got some beef. And I have this beef, which is already, you know, being seasoned and stuff. Then I have some red wine. Um, I have carrots, onions, some corn, and also I have some celery. So Really, really exciting to make this meal. Hope it comes out good, you guys. We're gonna see. We're gonna have, you know, some taste testers. I have some taste testers in the building. So hopefully it comes out good. This beef boy yum. And what else do we have? Okay, and then we have some bay leaves. So, oh, also we needed some, some thyme. So, Without further ado, I'm gonna just get started with this cooking video. So right now I'm about to use some garlic, onion, and black pepper, sea salt mixture, all in one, and I'm gonna just put it on the beef to season it. So I'm gonna put a decent amount, make sure you guys can see, put a decent amount of that seasoning. Alright y'all, so I'm gonna let this cook and then alright y'all, so I just flipped the meat and now I'm waiting for the second batch of meat to be done. I did some cut up some carrots. I'm about to cut up some Oh the onions is already cut up. So honestly I don't have to do anything for the onions. But celery. Okay, y'all, so I just want to come up here and show y'all the beef. So the beef is looking scrumptious. It's looking good. That's the beef that's cooking. And this is the beef that is done already. So I'm going to wait till this is finished. And I'm going to... I think this is enough. This is enough vegetables. So. Now, y'all, your girl is really becoming a chef in here. Like... Y'all, I don't know if I told y'all, I think I did tell you in my last vlog, I've been suffering anxiety and this is really like keeping my mind going. This is keeping me busy and I'm really happy. And I'm starting to cook more because this is probably what I needed. This right here. Her. Let me get back to y'all when this is almost done. My edges look crazy, y'all. Don't even mind that. Alright y'all, so hold on. Now I am skinning the, these potatoes 
because I just feel like there shouldn't be skin on them so I don't know I'm just trying to skin them if y'all have an easier way of how to skin potatoes let me know in the comment section below because this method is taking too damn long matter of fact I'm just trying to All right, y'all, I'm gonna try to cut up like two or three more potatoes. It's just like, it's take a lot of work. I'm about to sit down though, y'all, as I'm doing it, and I'm gonna get back to y'all when I finish cutting the potatoes. All right, y'all, so I finished doing the ingredients that I needed. I'm about to show you guys what it looked like. I'm super duper 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 du 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 tired. Super tired. So I'm about to show you guys. It's looking like this. It's looking pretty good, if you ask me. Looking pretty good, yay. So I'll let that sit, you guys, for 10 minutes with the potatoes in it. Then I'm going to add the beef. And we're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see how it comes out. All right, y'all. So now I'm adding the beef to the pot. So I'm going to let y'all watch me do that. I'm gonna let it sit for an hour and a half and we'll get back to it. Okay, you guys, so I burnt the bottom of the pot a little bit, but it's okay. Because look at the stew, y'all. It came out really, really good. Yes, got some healthy plates going on. Look at that, y'all. You see a little bit of burnt right there, but it's okay. I'm about to scrape everything else out. So, you know, ooh. But I hope you guys really enjoyed this cooking with me. I see I got all comfortable. I was waiting for a whole, what, hour for this to be done. So, if y'all like this video, make sure you give me a big fat thumbs up. Make sure you comment down below any other video ideas you want to see me do. And I hope to see y'all in my next video.